So let's get started right here. These are some of the pieces you're going to need. A base plate, one of these large channels, looks like this, wants to fall over probably. And then one of the thin pieces I talked about like this. Now this piece is gonna be held up either by connecting it to something like this or to a couple of these, doesn't matter. You will need a whole bunch of bolts. Don't take too many because you gotta return whatever you don't use at the end of the period. As long as they're not orange, they're the correct width. But my rule is to always use the smallest bolt that does the job. This one right here, too big. So I'm gonna take out all those large ones right away. And I'll probably end up using a combination of these others. You will need some standoffs and some shafts. Standoffs keeps things strong, shafts turn the motors. Uh, some spacers, which are these pieces right here. Uh, you'll need a bunch of gears. I'm just using one to get you started. You'll need some shaft collars. These are the old style, and these uh, ones right here are the new rubber shaft collars. I'll show you both of those, and you can decide which ones you want to use later. You'll need a black and an orange, or a purple and an orange um, driver, and you'll need some bearings, and I'll show you how all of that goes together in a moment.